I'm in Microsoft Azure and I'm in the virtual machines page where I've created some virtual machines. What I want to do is I want to make a change to my virtual machine by adding more RAM. So I can do that by clicking on my Azure test virtual machine. In a traditional Windows 10 or Windows Server virtual machine using Hyper-V, you could add RAM by going to the settings, clicking on memory, and then changing the amount of RAM as long as the virtual machine is turned off. But you don't have that option in Azure. So in order to increase RAM, you have to click on size. So we'll go down to where it says size in the list. And from here, you're going to see a lot of different options. So for instance, under RAM and gigabytes, we see we're currently on 8. So if we wanted to go to 16, for instance, we would have to click this option that we see here for 16. But we also see that it increases the amount of data disks as well as our CPUs, our virtual CPUs. So it's not going to just increase one thing, it's going to increase everything. And then when you have it the way you want it, you just click resize, and then you can boot up your virtual machine and it will have these new resources. So that's how you make changes to RAM in a virtual machine on Microsoft Azure.